Hey guys, so today I'm going to be teaching you how to install the Return of the Ancients mod. Alright, so this mod in particular is difficult to get because you can't find it on Nexus. Uh, that's because it's in beta, but it, you can still get it on a different area. Anyways, uh, let's get into it. So first thing, so you're going to want to right click on Subnautica here in Steam, click Properties. Uh, betas, make sure this is set to none since legacy is super glitchy, uh, and used only for, like, Nitrox, which is the multiplayer mod. Uh, once that's done, you're gonna wanna go to the gear icon on the right side, click manage, manage again, uh, browse local files, and this will open up your file explorer, right? So, now that you're in Subnautica, like, the folders, you're, mine might look a little bit different than yours, so that's fine. So you're going to want to make a new tab and go downloads and anything you download here, which is what we're going to be doing, will pop up here. So I would stay in downloads. Uh, now just open up your browser and type return of the ancients this chord. And ar ar this one, architects of the unknown. Um, click mod news. This is the first one you're gonna have to get. You need this one, like, for everything. So click here, visit site, uh, go down manual, and then slow download. And just, uh, wait for it to pop up. It'll appear right here, and that'll mean it's downloaded. Now that this is done, you're gonna go back here. Continue Discord, and you're going to do the same thing uh, with each one. So, let's find it again. Now, Nautilus, visit site. Uh, Vortex is for, Vortex is a mod manager, and we're not using that. So, so we, we just downloaded this, so don't worry about this when it pops up. I'll just click download, slow download. Three, two, one, it'll pop up here again. And now you can close it. Uh, ECC library. Manual. Oh. We have both of these already. Download. Uh, slow download. Again, it's just going to pop up here. Um, if you ever can't find it, click the three, li the three little dots. Go down to downloads and it'll open up the downloads again. Um... Alright, so uh, now we're on Architects Library, visit site, so uh, where is it, let's look, let's look, okay, so Architects Library download, right, now it's done, this is, see, this wasn't on uh, Nexus, this one's not on Nexus, now you're going to scroll down a little bit more, and, oh, it's not on here, so Discord, and click Return of the Ancients, Visit Site, and go down to here, Return of the Ancients, Demo.zip. And now that they're all, like, downloading here, this one's bigger because this is the main mod that we're downloading. Now it's all done, you go, so this is your downloads that you have, uh, so now it goes right here. You want to go to Weapon X first, highlight everything. Drag it into here, drop it right there. Place files and destinations. So, um, plugins, this one is not where you put your mods. It's in here. So, ignore this completely. That's like base Subnautica stuff. So, click Weapon X. And then most mods that you download will be in plugins, but some mods will tell you to put in patches, uh, core config, right? But most will be plugins, so just keep it in here. This this should be here. Um, now you can go ahead and delete that because it's uh, oh my goodness. All right, never mind. It's uh now that it's in here, uh, it's all good. So now you're gonna go here, turn the engines demo, and plugins, and then I would rename it so you know which one is which. Because there's going to be a couple things that say plugins. So click on it. 
the return of ancients. Now that's done, you can go here, back, Nautilus, open, plugins, again, rename it, if you don't want to lose track. Uh, Nautilus plugins. And go here, back, ECC library, plugins once again. Um, ECC library. All right, now you're on to the final one. So this is Architects Demo Library after you open it. Highlight the inside after you double click it, right? Drag it into here. And then, uh, here, I'll just click this. And then, Architect. And now you have everything downloaded. You can now close this, close this. Close that, click play, play Subnautica, it'll load, and if you followed all the instructions and made sure to open the files and then put them into BepinX plugins, it'll work. But if you don't open them and take the contents to put them in there, it won't work. So, yes, as you can see, it's turn the agents on that one, so it's working. Um, from here on, I'm just going to tell you how to get other mods, it's pretty simple. Um, go to options for uh, mods, and this is just how you like, manage the ones that you install. So let's click quit. Um, open back Microsoft Edge. Go Nexus mods. Alright, so now that we're in Nexus mods, you're going to want to type uh, Subnautica in the search bar, click Subnautica, you'll be in the Subnautica section now, so search map, or really whatever mod you want to do if you see it on YouTube. This is the one I'm using, just map. Alright, so manual, we already have that, download. Uh, slow down the... 3, 2, 1, it'll download there. Steam, manage, manage, browse local files, and create a new one, downloads, and Subnautica map. So open Subnautica map, or whichever mod you just installed, highlight the contents if there's more than one, drag it into Subnautica, go weapon X, oh, you're going to have to, now take it from Subnautica, or the weapon X, into plugins, it'll be in here, and now, if you click play, uh, your mod will work, and uh, just to prove it, I'll quickly show you in-game playing with the mod I just downloaded. Alright, so as you can see, uh, you go here for the map mod, click map, obviously. And uh, everywhere that you've explored will pop up here. It won't be just available for you though. You're gonna have to go everywhere. Um, now, test out the turn the engine spot. If we go past here. Uh, the turn the engine spot is still in demo though. So, if it's laggy or not as good as you want it to be, just give it a little bit of grace. Crash zone and into the void. Warning, passive bias scan is limited to 500 and meters in any is. direction. Please manually scan the object for a more comprehensive uh, measurement. It's tiny, we're very far away. We're still far away, but right? this is CDA data. giant. Like you would not believe. Wow. Yeah, this is the, uh, I think, I can't tell if this is the juvenile or the adult. But if, uh, watch out, so it's a and a Gnosis This is how big it is, so that's gigantic. Uh, the 
will be improvements on this model, obviously. So, yeah. Anyways, see you later.